What's up guys? Crazy Edit here. Welcome back. I hope you're having a great day. I'm having a pretty decent day myself. It's currently like like 2 o'clock in the morning right now. I'm running off of energy drinks and Subnautica. Yeah. <laughs> if you'll take notice, we are not in a tube full of fabricators and boxes and all kinds of other random stuff like we were in the last episode. No, we're in a multi-purpose room with a nice little ladder in the middle of it that goes up multiple levels. Um, I actually had a whole bunch of free time this weekend, and I decided to fill that free time with Subnautica, about seven and a half hours of it, and yeah, I got a bunch of stuff done. Let me go ahead and run out here and kind of give you, like, the base idea of what the base is. Huh. You see what I did there? You see what I did there? Let's actually swim away a little bit more. And right there, boom. Oh, you see that? There's a sea moth right there. There's a sea moth right there. That's right, I built a sea moth. There's a multi-purpose room. Oh, there's like a big old tower. Oh my gosh, there's like four big old towers. Remember how I was saying, like, I want a castle in the middle of the ocean type deal on top of the water? Yeah, that's what that's what I've kind of got started right here. I'm not done with it, though. I actually kind of want to make it a little bit higher. I might make it one or two more levels and then make the top level just surrounded in glass, kind of like this level is right here. That way you can have, uh, like, lookouts and stuff like that, and you can get a really good high vantage point. So we've got our main fabricating and entrance room right here. Uh, what I'm going to do is, in the middle of it, I'm going to eventually put a creature containment thing. And it's going to go all the way to the top. And it's going to be our main elevator. We're just going to swim into it, swim to the top, and be done with it. Because I'm going to be honest with you, like this whole ladder system right here kind of sucks when you've got it in multi-purpose rooms. Like it really, really sucks. All right, so uh, I think we're on the first level. Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Uh, are we? Are we? We are. Alright, so out here, I've also got some plants, some trees and stuff. And if you've been playing this game or you know anything about this game, you'll know that these trees and plants and all this only come from one place. That's right, the Southwest Island. I've been calling it the Northwest Island or the Northeast Island for so long, but I built a compass. You can see it at the top of my screen. I actually built a compass, and now I know what direction I'm facing. It's an amazing concept, and I can't believe that I've been wrong this whole time. But you know what? Stuff happens. Yeah, I actually went to the island. We are going to go there today again because I didn't I didn't do everything. Like, I ran out of inventory space, and I just came back because I pretty much just went there to gather up seeds and exterior grow beds so I can grow our little food thing right here. But I kind of feel like all of this is going to have to go away uh, just for the simple fact, like, I'm having some collision issues. Like, right here, I'm not colliding. But I am right here, and I could actually, I could build right there, but I can't build over there just because of that tower. It keeps going down too far. Maybe I'll build right there, and we'll just have like a notch in our platform. See, I could build, I could build like all right here and stuff. All right, all right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can figure that out later. That's no big deal. Let's actually keep moving, keep moving. That's actually pretty much all about the base. Um, all the rest of it is just empty rooms. So, yeah, there's nothing to see there. Uh, let's go back down. This is kind of what sucks about ladders. Let's go back down. We're right here. We're right there. Um, did I show y'all everything here? Yeah, we did. We did. Yep, uh-huh. So, over here, I did go ahead and actually add another, another side of the base that went down into the water. Or, it went down a little bit. Uh, this is going to be where the moon pool goes. Right here, it's going to hang off into this little area. And it should, the bottom of it where the water level is, should work out to where it's just right with the top of the ocean. I feel like it'll work. If not, then we might just go down one more one more deal and just put it in the water. I don't know. We'll have to see once we get it all learned. But speaking of getting stuff learned, like we've got, I've got so much stuff learned. Look at all this stuff. Look at all this stuff. I've been scanning stuff and learning things. We've almost got the moon pool. We only need one more of those in the scanner room. Uh, which, actually, I don't know how the scanner room is going to work if we put it up in the air. Like the little pods on the side of it. I don't think they're going to work or function properly if we put it up in the air. So we might have to... I might have to... Uh, that's not the right button. I might have to alter the design of the base a little bit and put it on the bottom of this, if I can. Or... Like, build one down and put it over here, and then put the moon pool on the other side. I don't know. We'll cross that bridge when we get there. 
But today, what I want to do, I need to go back to the southwest island, this island over here. Is it that island? Uh, is it the southwest? No, it's the northwest. I need to go back over to that island. Uh, we might get to the other island over here if we have time. If we run out of time, we're not going to get to it. But yeah, that's kind of what I want to do. Oh, here's a hot tip for you guys. A hot tip. If you're having trouble finding like the islands and stuff like that, and you have a fabricator, go like this. Just go like that. You see that little puff of cloud that's breaking through the, uh, the red wireframe of the foundation? Yeah, that's where the island is. Yeah, that's right. And you could do it to the other one. It's actually right there. You see that? Boom, that's where the other island is, right there. If you don't have a compass or you don't know where it's at, you could do that to find them. It's kind of a neat little trick I found when I was building this thing. I just happened to notice it. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and head to these islands. Hopefully, uh, I can find some stuff. I'll meet you guys there, and we'll see what we get. Oh, we're traveling up the mountain. Traveling up the mountain. We should be coming to this uh, first one on this peak, on the western peak of the southwest island i am pretty sure this is the southwest island now um i've already been to the habitat right there in the middle right there that's where i got all the plants and the grow beds and the, the multi-purpose room and all that stuff uh i don't think we need to revisit that uh because this game's been out for like four years and i'm pretty sure anybody that's been following this game knows what that all looks like i'm not gonna sit here and act like it's an amazing thing already got a stasis rifle so we should get titanium from this yeah uh one thing they did add in this game is like time capsules and stuff i found one of those and that's what had the stasis rifle in it that's an awesome concept i love it i love it all right what's in you all right water cool nice thank you uh what is this the observatory oh this is something i was wanting to look into because i was thinking about putting these on the top of our castle i was thinking about it I don't know if I'm going to do it yet. Maybe I will, because they could be like the big turrets on top. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Indoor grow bed. I don't have this. How is that different from the exterior grow bed? I guess the... Yeah, I guess it can be used inside of uh, like multi-purpose rooms and stuff. I don't think we're really going to have a, have a need for this, to be honest with you. But we've got it anyway. Is there anything else I need to scan? Um... Let's see. Oh, there's a PDA. Nice. Uh, we got Bart Togel's Log 3, Return from the Deep. Bulkhead. Oh, cool. Bulkhead. Man, you're taking a long time to scan this door. I really, I really wish you would hurry up. All right, thank you. It's getting dark. No, it's getting dark. All right, we got a new blueprint. Can we actually get up here? Can I get up here before it gets too dark to play the game? No, we can't make it over there. Is there anything on this? No? Alright, since it's super dark, and I really can't see nothing, and it doesn't look like anything in the record, dude, look at that moon. That is amazeballs. I'm actually going to head to the other uh, habitat or outpost or thingamajig over there. Wait till morning, and then I'll bring you guys back, okay? Alright, we should be getting up close to it. Oh, yes, here's the actual other habitat I was talking about. That's where we were before. All right, so let's... I've already got you. I've already got you. Is there anything on the outside I need to get? I don't think so. There's some pots in here. Uh, I don't I don't really need that. I, I just want... I want to scan this. Thank you. I mean, I'm pretty sure that's in my inventory now. Uh, but I appreciate that. Uh, is this the same pot right here? Is Are you the same pot? Uh, I think it is. But we do need this food, so let's go ahead and eat that. Uh, yeah. And you, 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 sure. Let's actually drop that because I think in this game, they still have it enabled to where if you like eat too much of one thing, I think it's like six items of the same thing. Like it'll actually hurt you. Oh, there's a PDA right there. Let's get this swivel chair. Oh, I think I already have this desk too. Yeah, I've already got this desk. Give me that PDA. Degassi voice log number one, habitat location. All right, cool. All right, all the epic music is happening. The epic music. Oh, my goodness. What is that on the horizon? It looks like there's some still some, like, visual stuff when you're looking at the map, like, from this high up when things aren't rendered in. Or some stuff might be going on. Because I did kind of, like, save the game and exit out of it and stuff like that. 
So I feel like something might be going on as far as like render distance. Maybe. I don't know. All right. So we're coming up on the bottom habitat. I just wanted to come down here to double check, make sure I got everything. Uh, we already got that desk. Yeah, yeah. Uh, there was a PDA in here and you could also get these like these. Uh, I, I can't remember what they're called. They're like wall planners or something like that. Yeah, you can get those and you can get like that light and stuff and get this grow bed and these plants. Let's actually grab that and eat that. Oh, I'm gonna eat you. Yes, that way it can increase our water intake. Uh, what are you? Are you just a, a light? Is that all you are? Yeah, you're just a light. Okay. Oh, what's this box? I already got whatever was in it. Cool. Um, uh, there was a spider in here, like a creepy crawly crab thing. Not in here anymore because I did have to kill it. Uh, let's go up here and I've already got that. Cool. There's nothing over here. Yeah, I just wanted to double check because the last time I was here, it was super dark. So, that being said, let's go ahead and head back to the main base. Because we do have some radio transmissions and stuff like that. And I do kind of want to see what they are. So, yeah, let's head back. I'll meet you guys there. This is Sunbeam. You know Aurora. We're from a little transgov on the far side of Andromeda. And we have a saying there. There's no bad without the good. No good without the bad. Sounds like you tasted a bunch of the former. But that only means you're overdue a whole lot of the latter. Might just be we're in. We're scanning for somewhere to park. We'll be in touch when we find it. Sunbeam out. Really? That's it? That's it? Dude, I was expecting like another life pod or something. That's it. Oh. So, I do actually have life pod 19. Like through the radio it told me where it was and everything like that but it's too deep for our sea moth to get to because it can only go 200 meters um we've also got this right here this proposed agassi habitat 250 meters uh which is also a little bit too deep we might be able to swim to it like get within 50 meters and just swim to it or whatever i don't know do we have anything else anything else i don't think there is anything else all right well I guess that's it for the radio, but I do feel like the uh, sunbeam is supposed to be in the, the next few transmissions. It's going to be coming to the planet and getting blowed up. Uh, spoilers: if you didn't know that the sunbeam gets destroyed, then uh, the sunbeam gets destroyed. So yeah, uh, I'm going to be heading to the northeast island now and looking around. Hopefully, I can find a battery charger or something like that, and like a wreck on the way. Because I'm really needing battery chargers because all of my batteries are dying and it really sucks. But yeah, I guess I'll meet you guys there or I'll meet you guys at a wreck. You know what? Now that I think about it, I th think there might be some battery chargers near the, uh, the actual Aurora. You know what? Let's go over there and look. Let's just go look over there. Oh, is there stuff right here? I don't see any battery chargers. I see something else though. What are you? Oh, a grav trap. I haven't used one of these yet. I think this is actually new. Or at least new to me since I, the last time I played the game. What's in you? Nothing? All right, cool. I wonder what the grav trap does. I don't know. There's so many questions right now. Why is there no more loot? Why is there not a battery charger? Ah, oh, there we go. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff around me. Oh, there's a bar table. There's a bar table. Give me the bar table. Yeah, that's right. We got an epic bar table. That's why you need to play that awesome music. Heck yeah. And hopefully these sand sharks don't kill me. A scanner room fragment. Yes, we got the scanner room now. Awesome. We could try that out. Hopefully. Oh, wait. No, we need one more piece. Ooh, that kind of stinks. Kind of stinks. Give me this metal right now. Right meow. Uh, there should be another scanner room fragment right around here. I feel like. Um... Pretty sure there should be. Is it one of like one of these panels or something? Maybe. No, there's metal. Give me that metal. What is that epic music, man? Why? Because there's wreath backs above me? Is that why? I mean, is that why the game's trying to freak me out right now? Oh! Oh, what is that? A trash can! Yes! Dude, this is the most valuable resource in this whole game! The trash can. And if you don't believe me, then you're wrong. Because it gives you the ability to delete objects. So yeah, that's like the ultimate power. Get away from me, Sand Shark. 
Ugh, you're nasty and disgusting. Nobody likes you. All right, so we're in the mushroom tree biome now. As you can tell, there's mushroom trees everywhere. And I'm actually, I actually think this is where you could find pieces for the Cyclops. I'm pretty sure, maybe. Yes, Cyclops bridge fragment, nice. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Overall progress, yada, yada, yada. Okay, cool. Uh, where's my sea glad? Right there, or my sea moth. Oh, let's get back in. All right, so now we might actually be on the hunt for a cyclops. Parts. Plural. Yeah. I think, I think they're kind of like in this middle spot. Hey, there's another thing right there. Wait, did I just see something? Did y'all just see that? What are you? Oh, yes, 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 yes. More stuff. Give me this. All right, so this is another bridge fragment. That's two or three. Cool. I think there's like six or nine parts in total. I don't know. I could totally look at my PDA and find out, but I'm too lazy and I'm not going to do that right now. I'd rather scan stuff. So we got all the bridge fragments. What else is it we we need? Uh, let me get in the bridge, in the, uh, the, the words, in the sea glide or sea moth and find out. Uh, let's see. You, 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 and... Where is the Cyclops? Right there. So we need... We got the bl the bridge blueprint. I think we need the whole stuff. And then the stuff for the drive. Like the, the motor or engine or whatever you want to call it. Huh. Interesting. I wonder if it's actually around here. I think it might be. I don't know. I'm going to keep looking. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, sweet Jesus. I think there's a Leviathan right behind me. I don't know. I'm not going to turn around and look right now. Oh, yeah. There's right. It's right there. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, we're right here by the ship, by the way. Uh, the Aurora. Yeah, there's like life pods and metal and all kind of stuff around here. And there's a Leviathan right there. So, yeah, I don't know if it's very wise to be right here right now. Uh, where did it go? Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, that just totally scared me. It was a rock. Everybody calm down. It's just a rock. Dude, this game is so spoopy at night. Oh. Ooh, just take a deep breath. It's okay. It's just a video game. Yeah, you're not scared. You're not you're not scared at all of a Reaper Leviathan grabbing your sub and then ripping you apart. Nope, you're not. And there's like glitches and stuff. Oh my gosh. Is it above me? Is it below me? Is it near me? I don't think it is. I don't think it is. I think we're safe. Is that it right there? Was that it? Did y'all see that? Uh, I kind of want to go scan this stuff. There was some stuff right here. Uh, what is this? What is this? There was something right there. What are you? Your salt. There's a thing in you. What are, what are you? Uh, I think that's the tractor cannon. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Real fast. Real fast. Real fast. Scan it. Scan it. Scan it. Uh, the propulsion cannon. Cool. We got it now. Let's go. Get back into the thing. Woo! Oh, what are these? Are these more time capsules? Is that what this is? What are you? Cyclops engine fragment. Never mind. This is even better than a time capsule. There's another one right here. Oh, 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 oh. Hopefully there's a third one. Dude, if there's a third one somewhere, I'm going to be so happy. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Let me in. Because right, I think we're at the engines of the Aurora right now. And I think there's actually another Leviathan over this way as well. Uh, there is a wreck to our uh, south. Oh yeah, there's another Leviathan. Go, 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 No, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Yeah, if you've never seen one, here it is. Oh my gosh, it's so evil looking. You are super wicked, bro. Yeah, we're just, we're gonna do our best to stay away from you. Let's keep, uh, going this way. Uh, there's another piece right there. I really want that piece. Bro, are you gonna leave me alone and let me get this piece? Huh, huh? I feel like, I feel like he's going to leave us alone. Uh, let's go right here. Go, 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 go. Uh, scan, scan, scan. Get it, get it. Oh, man, you're going so slow right now, scanner. Oh, we got it, we got it. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's get out of here. He's right there. Oh, we're booking it, we're booking it. Full speed, full speed, let's do it. What is that? What is that? Oh, that's the Aurora. Okay, cool. Let's get out of here. Oh, that's super weird. There's like a crazy eclipse happening or something. This is not cool. Not cool. Actually, it's kind of pretty. It's cool. Yeah, that's cool. We're at a wreck. I was on the way to the uh, north, northeast, uh, the north island. That's where I was going. 
uh, to get some diamonds to grab a laser cutter because I felt like these battery chargers are actually inside of these wrecks and I can't get into any of them except for this one without a laser cutter. So yeah, we're in this one now. Um, I kind of just want to... Is there anything in this? I don't think so. I kind of just want to uh, explore this a little bit and see all the things we're going to get. Uh, open, open, open. Thank you. Oh, there's all kinds of crazy stuff. And oh, there it is. Dude, we got a battery charger. Yes. Yes. That was like the one thing kind of holding my exploration back. But I still need to go to the North Island and get some diamonds for a laser cutter. So yeah. Oh, there's a pot. Look at that. And a bench. We're getting both of them at the same time. This is kind of weird. Okay. All right. What is this? Oh, there's a plant shelf. Uh, that's exciting. Super exciting. But we still can't get down into there because we don't have a laser cutter yet. So we need the diamonds. Um, oh, wow. All this epic music is going off all at once. Battery charger fragment. We've already got it. Battery charger fragment. Now, what is, what is this other thing? What is this other thing? Fragment, fragment. Okay. All right. Is that it? There's a new... Is that a different pot right there? A chic pot... Plant pot. All right. Cool. Give me that chic stuff, man. I'm all down for that chic stuff. So it looks like... Yeah, it looks like we really can't go any farther in this. Until we actually have a laser cutter. So I'm going to actually... Oh, hey, what's up, piranha thing? I'm actually going to run to this northern island. Grab some diamonds. And yeah, I'm going to meet you guys back at base. And we're making a laser cutter. We got a laser cutter now. That's awesome and amazing. We're going to make this battery charger. Should we put it right there or up here? Uh, let's just put it right there for now because I only got materials to make one. And what I'm going to do is put a battery charger there and a battery charger there. And then I'm going to put power cell chargers right here. And then battery storage right there. Um, actually my battery storage is right there, but you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. We've already got a trash can built. Um, it's kind of awesome. Uh, I need to eat food. Uh, let's actually, this actually works for what I'm going to do. Uh, let's run out here. Let's run out here real quick. Faster. Run faster. Let's run faster. Grab some of this lantern fruit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eat you, you, and you. Cool. We got calories now. Can we get past all this? Awesome, we can. Now, the piece de resistance. The thing that we want. The thing that's going to help us. Not really, but it's going to be awesome and amazing. The moon pool. If we can ever build it. Okay, right there. Is it actually going to hook to anything? Uh, I feel like it is. We're doing it. We're doing it. As the sun rises, we have a moon pool. Boom, and it is joined. And the water level in it is weird looking, actually. Let's actually use the ladder. Yeah, the water's super weird in it because we're at the surface of the ocean. Uh, <laughs> but hey, it's a thing now. I don't know. Maybe if it kind of freaks me out too much, I'll change it. But yeah, we got a moon pool now. We got everything else. We got a lot done today. Um, guys, that being said, that is going to be the end of what after this week's human contact is normal to experience psychological discomfort. Thank you so much, robot, as I'm trying to do my outro. Uh, like I was saying, this is going to be the end of this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you like this video, get crazy on the like button. Feel free to leave a comment down in the comment section. And have a great day, guys. Till next video. Bye.